Hi, I'm Ted. Well, my parents named me Theodore, but Ted is a shortened version of Theodore. But I guess you already knew that. I like comic books. I'm also a movie aficionado. Most people I meet describe me with such words as unwieldy or maladroit. This is Liz. Liz sometimes goes by Lizard521 in the online chat room where we met, but I haven't figured out what it means yet. Liz thinks it's okay that I'm unwieldy. I asked Liz if she would hang out with me sometime. She says she's more comfortable with words like date, but I find that one-syllable words are often exceptionally awkward. I haven't been on many dates. Well, none, actually. But I calculated that the local library would be as good a place as anything. Liz says she likes books. We agreed on 1,500 hours, or 3 o'clock, in civilian time. I showed up a little early, just in case. So I wait. The library is full of many kinds of people, but especially people who don't have internet access at their own house. I wonder what homeless people use the internet for. She said she would arrive by push scooter, but surprisingly, over the past two hours, near a dozen different people showed up on scooters, and after the first four, I stopped running after them and giving them bear hugs. Oh. Oh. Hi. I'd prepared a speech for this exact moment, but as soon as she started talking, I forgot the entire exchange that I had prepared. Um... Mm. Let's go inside. I'll race you to the third floor. the date out in my mind. For some reason I thought a foot race would be a good way to impress her. The way it actually turned out was kind of different than I had imagined, though. She showed me some of her favorite books, and I showed her some of mine. But it turns out that her favorite kind of books were in sharp contrast to my own. She preferred fantasy books where Prince Charming comes and sweeps the heroine off of her feet. I prefer the kind of books where Prince Charming has superpowers and valiantly battles ghastly villains. I decided that we were hungry based on the position of the sun. My survival instincts kicked in, and I recalled a comic book I had once read and realized that a date implied fine dining. Then came the part of the date for which I was the most nervous. My beloved movies and comic books offered no advice or comfort for this particular event. We made our way onto the doorstep. Isn't she going to go inside? She's fiddling with her key. Her one key. What is she... Oh... I offer no advice either.